Hey, how's it going everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com, and it is our update for Friday, August 7th, 2020. Free pick coming up in the NBA in just a moment. I uh, wanted to tell you before I get to everything, including the free play, that uh, if you've yet to take advantage of that free $60 offer to try things out over at DocSports.com if you're not yet a member, real cool way to do it if you want to give it a try. You click on that link below the video, you get yourself set up for a free $60 account, which you can use. Uh, on any of my daily packages or anybody else on the roster at DocSports.com. It is as simple as that. All right, uh, listen, over Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, been a real nice run in, in these USA sports that we're so glad to have back. 10 and 4 and up $2,910 for $100 per unit betters in the NBA, Major League Baseball, NHL, and PGA combined. Here's what we've done. We've gone 3 and 1 since Tuesday in the NBA, up 1070 uh, Major League Baseball, 3 and 2 since Tuesday. Tuesday up $775. PGA perfect 2 0 sweep on Thursday, opening round matchups. We had a three ball matchup winner with Abraham Answer, four star play, a six star play on Victor Hovland, uh, who got the win, the matchup win over Matsuyama. And in the NHL, 2 and 1, $65 is the profit, better than losing. Uh, but I missed one yesterday. I had a seven star on the Blues. And uh, listen, even though they were up 4 3 after two periods, uh, they just were not the better team and sometimes that happens Vegas played their tails off uh, for three periods and almost almost uh, went into the third period with a little bit of doubt popping up in the back of their minds because they were down 4-3 despite completely uh, outplaying the Blues. So that, that really stunk, obviously, uh, to lose that game with the Blues, but they were not the better team, and, and the right team won. Unfortunately, we were on St. Louis. So overall, winning uh, days over the last three days, the nice little run going here in all four of those USA sports, and again, combined in those sports, 10-4, and four, end up over $2,900 for those wagering $100 per unit. Here's what's going on for Friday. I got a full card. We've got a four star in the NBA at DocSports.com on my Handicappers homepage. I've got one Major League Baseball play. And also, I uh, wanted to mention that we are involved in the NHL. Listen, we're five and two, our last seven in the NHL. Gonna come back with a four star play on Friday. Uh, I mentioned the four star in the NBA and PGA. We've got a six-star head-to-head matchup in round two action on Friday, and that's going to be our only play in the PGA, but it is a six-star. I mentioned we went 2-0 and on Thursday. Well, with that six-star win yesterday on Hovland, uh, we are now on a 4-0 and run with PGA six-star plays, and we're up over $2,500 for $100 per unit better. So we're going to rack it up and do it again. Friday, one head-to-head -head matchup in second round action, and it is a six-star play. So plenty of, uh, of stuff going on for us on Friday. And also, don't forget about the eight star this week in a NASCAR. First one of the entire calendar year that's before and after the virus. And you know how well we've done a NASCAR. 39 and 18 with our last 57 matchups going back to May of 2019. All right, so our free pick. Yesterday, bad call on the Milwaukee Bucks. Uh, we said we were going to play them in the first half. They did not play well at all for the first half and part of the third. They were down 63 to 40 and then were able to come back and get the win. Uh, so just a game in which was the opposite of what I thought was going to happen. I just got to uh, be candid. Thought they were going to play well in the first half and uh, then kind of take it off in the second half and it went the other way around. So uh, Milwaukee gets the win. We had the other side. Let's get back in the win column and start a new winning streak here uh, with the free pick videos. We're going to back to San Antonio Spurs. Uh, that'll be on uh, Friday. And that game goes, by the way, note that time start 105 p.m. Eastern, 10.05 a.m. Pacific. Listen, Utah is going to offer a bunch of catch and shoot. It's what they do. They finally had a good game doing so from the three-point line last time out. They're 2-2 two and two so far on the restart. San Antonio, same record, but they've had a day off in between games. And I really think Coach Pop is going to have uh, the defensive schemes ready to go against what Utah does, that catch and shoot, which is you know they're one of the best teams in the NBA at doing so. And San Antonio fighting for that record you know, NBA 23 straight years to make the postseason. And uh, so they're not going to give up here. And I love the attitude of Patty Mills. I love the fact that he said, we're not quitting here. We're getting the young guys mixed in with the veterans and we're playing to win. So I like the attitude. You know you're going to get that out of, out, of a, out of a Popovich coach team. I think San Antonio is the right side here. I don't think Utah's catch and shoot is going to be able to uh, win this game for the Jazz. So we're going to back the Spurs. Virtual must win mode for San Antonio. I think they get it. And uh, that'll be the free play for Friday. And again, it goes at 105 Eastern. So be sure to mark that down. All right, that's going to do it for me for Friday. If you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button and be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Spritz or Docs. 
Sports.com right back here late Friday night with Saturday's report.